What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to the most underrated channel on YouTube. All right, what do we have today? Uh, today, like I said from the last video, I have a, a few balls that uh, that need to be unboxed. So today I'm going to do unboxing of the of the ball. Let me bring it up for you guys. So I don't know which one. Which one you guys want to do first, the top or the bottom? Let's just do the top, right? Easy, easy peasy. Let me find my dots. All right, you ready? Let's do a quick one. So I, I, I don't know what was in here. So um, it's gonna be a surprise, maybe. All right, let's open it up. Oh, do you guys see my address in there? Ah! Check this out. What's that say? What does that say? This is the rock, the rock, baby. Do you smell what the rock is cooking? All right, all right, let's open it up. Yeah, baby. Look at that. What is paper? Authentic City. All right, certification of Authentic City basketball. All right, let's put that on the side. But you know, anybody can make this paper. It's just paper. So, uh, yeah, just paper, no serious number or anything. But anyway, let's put this back away. Ooh, more needles. Needles. All right, here it is, guy. The rock. All right, this is like the picture of a, the outline of the skyscraper in New York City. And I think this ball is actually from New York City. Um, yeah. So the address that ship it from is from New York. All right. Um, yeah, this ball is pretty good. The Rock C2C, core to core maybe? Core to Carbo Technology. All right, let's start with the appearance of this ball. Um, so yeah, this is got that nice golden border around the logo, the rock, you know, black in the center. And then uh, C2C stands for core to core technology, deep pebble channel, you know, like I mentioned it. Um, I don't know what is this for. Uh, Right here on the bottom, uh, MG4000 CP NF. I'm, I'm not sure what it is, so if you guys know what that means, let me know. Um, official size, indoor use only. All right, guys, do not use that this ball outside. Uh, the company that make this ball is um, uh, Anaconda. My Anaconda, all right, Anaconda Sport, I think they based in New York, not New York City, somewhere in New York, uh, but yeah, so I feel like this ball is like the East Coast thing, um, you know, US East Coast, you know, got this nice uh, skyscraper, uh, I think it's in New York, right, this look like a, I think this was a twin tower, I don't know if you guys can see this, two tower, twin tower. Uh, 
so who used this ball? Um, I think uh, Medano All American. So for those who don't know what uh, Medano All American is, is uh, basically all the best player from the U.S. or from uh, Canada. Uh, they compete. Usually, it's like a, a NBA All Star, but for high school. So all a lot of big name player uh, in the NBA, they they actually um, participate in Medano uh, All American. Um, I I think the date is supposed to be on April, every April or so. They would like that on uh, ESPN, uh, but. I don't know. I I don't think they did it uh, this year because the the COVID nineteen uh, that happening. So, uh, but yeah, man, I, I think this is the official uh, ball for McDonald All American, um, and then some high school use them. Uh, I'm not sure what division. Maybe I, I look up a little bit uh, after or do a little bit more research. Uh, so when I do uh, when I do a full review on this ball, it's you know I can tell you guys all about it. Uh, this ball actually is pretty good grip, I guess. Yeah. So as you already know, I don't have big hand. Uh, I'm I'm like my hand is average, so I can palm this ball easily. You know, even when I move up and down. See, usually the if the ball is hard to palm. If you go like this, or you would go like that, it would just slide off. Uh, so this ball is grip nice. Um, this ball, you know what this ball feel like? This ball feel like the uh, the evolution, right? When when evolution uh, brand new, it feels similar, but this ball is actually feel more grip. It's very similar to. Um, Where's that ball go? Oh, so over there on the floor, uh, Biden Elite. Uh, Biden Elite uh, have a very similar to this also. Uh, as for now, no gym for me because, you know, I don't want to get a virus. I have a kid, man. You know, my kid at home, I don't want to spread virus. I mean, bring virus home just to uh, test the basketball. I didn't even get paid for this, you know, and then bring virus and stuff at home. Uh-uh. But anyway, um... Oh, one thing I noticed, because uh, I, this ball is like been around for a long time, uh, so I I play with this ball quite often, and then from what I observe, um, the channel here, uh, or the groove, this black line, uh, over time, uh, it, it kind of shrink it, um, so it would like create like gaps, uh, in between the line, so. You know, I would say that's the only downside of this ball, and then um, also the uh, the grip kind of a uh, go out a little bit faster, but but I, I feel like it's definitely still still better than the uh, Wilson Evolution. Um, so I don't know if um, if they change any technology on this to make it more. Uh, doable or they, they switch a little bit of uh, the material, switch it up so this ball will be more uh, durable. Uh, but yet yeah, from what I noticed, uh, this the channel will just shrink it a little bit and then you know it's create that gap. Uh, also, you know, after maybe two to three years, the, the grip kind of uh, wear off. So. But I mean, it's no complaint. This ball is actually very affordable. Um, you can get this ball is a little bit under, uh, what you call it, fifty dollars. So it's, you know, between forty-five to uh, to uh, fifty bucks, depend uh, on the season or on the depend on the demand of the ball. Uh, I got it for I think it was forty dollar, but that plus tax and stuff it come up to like 42 but it's it's still one of my favorite ball to play in um, you know it's, it's got that soft feeling to it um, you know the the Wilson Evolution have that soft feeling also but then the grip is c 
kind of different, right? I, I like this script better. Wilson Evolution is have that like a, a smoother grip. Uh, like this one have that you know that rough grip that you actually can feel in hand. Uh, and when when this ball um, brand new, it's just it's just ready to play. You don't need to break it in or anything. Like even now, I, I didn't put any air on it. It's still still good. Um, oh, and now I didn't talk about air. I think when this ball uh, the grip start to wear out and stuff, the air leakage kind of start uh, to become a problem, right? Um, so hopefully with this C2C stuff, it's, you know, improved a little bit. So, but yeah, that, that's it. Um, catch you guys in the next video. Like, subscribe. You like, if you don't like it, whatever. Subscribe, you don't want to subscribe, whatever to. Peace. Yeah.